Okay, now we're talking about the maintenance on our chain system for the belt. The chain, treat it like a big motorbike chain. In the first 12 to 18 months of use, it will stretch just like any, any chain similar to this. And the procedure to adjust the chain, uh, we have our bearing block on the driver and passenger side on the front of this lay shaft here. The procedure is to loosen off, back off these four main bolts holding the bearing block on both sides, back off the lock nut here on, on the, the two adjuster bolts, and then uh, make sure that the bolts are free. We put anti-seize inside here, but over time water will get in there and, and you'll want to make sure you get the right torque setting. So you've got to make sure that these are free and then run the belt. While you're running the belt, adjust the torque to 40 Newton meter on both sides. What you do here, you do on the passenger side as well. So you've backed off the four bolts, you've backed off this, you've adjusted these to 40 Newton meter, walk around to the other side again, do the same procedure on the other side. So if you don't have access to a torque wrench, or you're in the field, say you've gone for a three month contract out in the middle of nowhere, you can use a screwdriver. Make sure you put a rag on here so you don't damage the paintwork. And the idea is to lift the chain up like this. You can see here that the chain lifts up nice and easily. I'm not putting too much pressure and it's not bending at the links here. So I know that if I can move it like that, that's got a good amount of tension on that chain. If I can't move the chain at all, it's far too tight. And if I lift it up and it starts bending, it starts pivoting at the link points, it's too loose, okay? So we went away from this procedure and went to 40 Newton meter to make it easier for the operator to actually adjust it. But if you need to, you can use that procedure. We know that in the first 12 to 18 months, it could stretch, the chain could stretch six to 12 to 15 millimeters of stretch. And what I mean by stretch is that that bearing block will move forward six millimeters over a 12 month period or seven to 10 millimeters. So you need to get into the habit of adjusting that bearing, bearing block every month. It may only move half a millimeter, get into the habit of doing it. It will save you a costly repair bill in the future. If you don't do it and you skip a tooth on one side and the other, it can cost you a lot of money or for the fact of a 10 to 15 minute job to adjust the, the, the tension on the chain.